find cos 300 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 300 now you should check 300 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 300 lies between 180 and 360 this is 180 into 1 and this is 180 into 2 between these two numbers 300 lies next 300 is close to which number this is close to 360 so in place of 300 now we should write 360 minus 60 so this will become cos in place of this we write this 360 minus 60 this is your step 1 next cos now in place of this we should write 2 into 180 minus 60 next here we have 180 so cos is not going to change it will remain cos and inside we get this angle 60 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 2 and 2 is even and all the even multiples of 180 they lie in either in the first or in the fourth quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have negative that means angle lies in the fourth quadrant and in the fourth quadrant cos is positive so we should put plus so plus cos 60 is 1 by 2 this is our answer